ladies and gentlemen, this is the Mark Kippian Emperor with the top five generation two Pokemon that deserve my guns. So why don't we just get right started? Number five. Mega Kingdra. So Kingdra is an amazing Pokemon in good competitive league. It has pretty balanced stats. So I liked this finding of it. I feel like it still emphasizes on water and dragon, but adds a little bit of flying there, so we, we could give Kingdra oh, some more flying moves. But overall, just boost Kingdra's stats. This would definitely either fall in OU or even Ubers, because Mega Kingdra to the P. So, yeah, th th that's, y you just see why. Anyway, next, number four, Mega Delibird. So, Delibird is a pretty bad, just spikes, destiny bond setupper that just doesn't have a lot going for it. So, by Dragoneth, I really like this design. Um, just, just gives it more flair and just makes it look more wintry, but powerful. I say boost its attack and turn it into a, a normal attacker and give it some more uh, physical moves. So, and I see this with some physical boost being actually pretty competitive. Competitive, like you could just be, you know, kind of, kind of like a better Mega Glaze, to be honest. But it would probably just be in like R U or U U, probably like kind of close to Mega Glaze. Anyway, number three, Mega Macargo. So first off, I just want to say that I had this idea for Mega Macargo, where so it would have like water pouring down its rock, and then get uh, an abil and then get water absorb, but couldn't find any design. So I have to do with this by Zyraton. I don't know if I said that right, but anyway, so. Just, I like the idea of the rock bursting and the flames coming out. And the ability I picture for this is uh, the same ability as Primal Groudon. I forgot uh, what it's called. Oh yeah, Desolate Land. Oh yeah, its stats are going to only get a small change, but it's definitely going to get a huge boost since it's gonna be immune to water attacks basically and solar beam <laughs> is gonna be OP so yeah that's number three probably gonna be totally OP but eh maybe if they made like a mega polytoad and they'd give that a uh, primal Kyogre's ability who knows anyway number two and Sadly but surely, Politoed is not in any of these. Number two is Mega Dunsparce. Dunsparce, one of the weakest Pokemon, and everybody loves to laugh at it. But let's make Dunsparce good, guys. So I imagine this as being either normal flying, normal dragon, or what I think should happen dragon flying. Give it give it a huge boost in uh, in all of its stats but especially physical attack. And then you know how Mega Launcher like raises uh pulse and spears? I say make an ability that raises Wing and tail attacks and give it to Mega Dunsparce. So because you got that big tail, you just whip 
magic dragon tail on that thing. Pretty good. And then like, I don't know, just eh, wing attack. I don't know, steel wing. Just, the wing part is going to be the less useful one. But you see those wings. No, wing attacks either do more or do less. I don't know. I'm just coming up with stuff, but this would probably... Oh yeah, I'd give it some much better moves. Uh, and then, this would... If it's what I said, I to be honest, I think it would be you, you, or above. Probably OU, if it was like this. But, definitely don't want to switch into it, because, well... Dunsparce can't survive a hit. And excuse me, <laughs> sorry about that. But number one, all of the Johto starters. Now, I agree with this one. The Johto starters are kind of horrible. <laughs> but anyway, let's just, like, I think that they need the biggest boost. Like Sinnoh, we don't need Megas for those. Gen 5 would be kind of cool to get it. And then Gen 6, it would be good if they all got it. But Greninja better not get. But Greninja would either get Protean and be super OP. Or never be. Or never have its Mega played because Protean OP. <laughs> but anyway, so. First, Meganium. I could see that this design just gives it a lot more defense, special defense, and HP. And I could see it going with a fairy typing also. So give it some fairy moves, all that jazz. Next, my boy for Alligator. Now, for Alligator, I really like this design, but. It just has me kind of on the edge of what other type it should get. And I feel like this cannot be a plain water type, but I feel like there's so many other types that should go with it. But I've narrowed it down to the top two. Either dark type, because it has kind of that like sinister kind of vibe, but give it more like and crunch is one of for alligators main moves but i say go with a more darker palette if you were to give it to turn it into a dark type or steel type because it kind of seems like armored steel type is probably what it would be if this design was chosen and yeah probably well yeah meganium probably like you you for alligator ou ish and then megatice flosion ou probably and let me explain what i think so i really like the idea of smog and just it's more sinister stuff so if for alligator was dark type i'd say that this should be a fire poison type because you know like smog kind of has that like poisonous feel to it and all that stuff. Plus it kind of looks like a poison type. But what's probably going to happen is for alligator, steel type, and fire dark type. Or they could all just have the same typing. Who knows? But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. This is the Mud Kippy Never signing out.